This one? Never mind, it's pretty fucking cool. How does a mistake like this even happen? And it's like super hot too. This guy is gonna pull his fucking face out of there and he's gonna look like Red Skull from the Avengers. Come on! We can fucking do this! Is there just a fireman on the other side of that wall shooting a hose through and hitting him with it? Ah, uh, that should help. Is that the end? Oh god! <laughs> How is this happening? Oh lord, it's coming in again! Like a fucking submarine malfunction. You can do this! It's like when you hit a fire hydrant in GTA. Just turn the water off! Is this even a plumber? Where did you... Is this just like your neighbor who said he can fix it? Even I know how to handle this. Come on! Here we are. We're back in the helm. Grandma's got the old wet back out. That ought to fix it. Alright, it looks like we finally got her under control, I think. But it, you can never be... Th it's steaming. The water is so hot, it is fucking steaming. That guy is not getting out without third degree burns. And even worse, it's being filmed. So he's getting burned and losing his job soon. Fucking rough. He, yeah, he is actually just getting reduced to ash in there. He's being cremated by the sink. Looks like we finally got it though. Alright, now that we've boiled half the bathroom, looks like we're finally good. Nope. Spoke too soon. Every step she takes makes like a puddle of water blast out from her footsteps. Jesus Christ. It's like a Naruto running across- Oh god! Get out of there quick! You're in the danger zone! <laughs> no! The rivers of hell have been unleashed again! Damn you! Quick! Grandma, get in there with the vacuum! Christ! We got a code red! Holy shit! Oh no! <laughs> Let's get another vacuum in here. Two's better than one. And maybe another plumber. Because a real plumber is better than whoever this guy is. Jesus fucking Christ. It's like a ride at Universal. Oh God. Oh, the apartment's already lost. Just collect your things and leave. It's over. It belongs to the sink now. Oh, here we go. He's got a big bucket! That'll fix it! Let's go! The reinforcements have arrived. The special tools are here. If we can catch all of the water, we'll win. It's a war of attrition. We'll just catch more water than it puts out. It's easy. Are you calling the police or something? What do you mean, what are the police supposed to do? I'd call the police in this situation too, like help. A uh, fucking plumber is assaulting me with my own sink. Yeah, I can still hear it spraying. It's still This guy's gonna fucking drown. He's gonna literally dry drown pretty soon. Oh my fucking god. It's not even connected to the water supply of the apartment building. This is coming straight from the ocean floor. That guy is getting cooked. By the time he finally leaves the bathroom, he's actually just gonna look like Larry the Lobster from Spongebob. Oh, Jesus Christ. How is that even happening? <laughs> Did we beat it? Is the boss battle over? Man. 
Water levels are always the worst, am I right? Jesus Christ. What a disaster. Oh, good idea. Reroute the water into the toilet. Now, maybe if we're lucky, we can overflow the septic tank and have it shooting shit water throughout the apartment, too. <laughs> yes. Oh, fuck! Oh, God, Jesus! Lord! We're back for more! Yeah, I'd say so. It is definitely ruined. You pissed off Aquaman, and he's he's not taking it easy here today. Oh, I it's it's the calm before the storm. I have a feeling it's coming back. Fucking what the hell is this shit? This is worth fucking thousands. Yeah, that's that was a really dumb argument. I'm not turning the water off because it's a hundred dollars. Meanwhile, the whole apartment is ruined. Oh god, it's- <laughs> It's even more aggressive now, you pissed it off in phase six of the fight. Jesus Christ. That man is getting pressure washed right in his goddamn mouth. I at least respect that he hasn't just given up. If it was me, I would have just left. I would have just walked out and been like, I fucking retire, I'm done. Good luck. I would have just fucking busted the sink and leave. Oh man, that is, that is a disaster in there. Looks like we finally, I think we finally beaten it. Hey, at least we at least we've stopped it before it caused any major damage. We got ahead of this one. It could have been a lot worse. Good work, team. Fuck yeah. Textbook. I'm thinking maybe like a three star review on the plumber's services, maybe. No, the plumber. I don't think it was the plumber's fault. It must have just been something with the pipes. The plumber did everything he needed to. Everything by the book. The apartment complex requires a $150 fee to be paid every 30 minutes the water is turned off? Holy shit. So it's entirely the landlord's fault and obviously the plumber. Wilmer, confident in his abilities and armed with his trusty five-gallon bucket, knows that he will always get her return business if he pulls this off. He gets underneath the sink and unleashes a 90 PSI torrent of steaming hot water. <laughs> hey, if anyone can handle 90 PSIs of boiling water, it's fucking Wilmer. Wilmer ain't got no problem with that. His skin is made out of steel, goddammit. For all the morons who complain that I should have put down the camera and helped this waterlogged jackass, I chose not to help for liability's sake and instead document the incident. Absolutely the right call. I know for a fact, and it's probably not like this now, but I guarantee a lot of people are like, why the fuck didn't you help? Like as if he's supposed to do something. What he's supposed to do? Start doing like water bending techniques to put it back in the wall? Like there's not a whole lot of wiggle room for two people to be handling the same glory hole down there under the sink. So him filming is absolutely the best call. Plus then if he helped and it still did this, he would then be liable for some of the damage I imagine. No doubt. He made the right call for sure.